Ah, some brand new official servers for me to play on. Let's join it. Purchase required. Five dollars, five dollars to play on an official server. What is this madness? Paying to play on official PVP? Paying to get raided? What is this all about? Appalachia, a brand new mod map that just released a few weeks ago, created by Kaluga Studios, was actually one of the very first, in fact, I think the very first mod map that was teased by even Snell Games to join Ark Ascended. And he's officially here, though compared to other premium maps such as Fartel Fine, which is $10. Why is this one in particular $5? Let's jump in and find that. All right, create. We got spawn points. We got lots of spawn points. From easy to hard, what are the easy ones? The easy ones can't even be seen on the map right now. Is the map just that big? What is going on? All right, let's start the easiest one. White Sands Inlet. Enlighten me with wonderful looking, gorgeous, lovely maps. Lovely bit of lag loading there, but that's normal for maps, you know. Nothing new. Feeling very ominous, feeling very misty, cloudy, sandstone around me, a bit of greenery. But what else is there? Oh, good grief. Okay, we see trees. I'm boiling hot, right off the off. Hypothermia, brilliant. Welcome to Ark. When can you start? Will I bump into any players, though, is the question, right? That's going to raid me and rob me of my $5. There we go. Perfect job done. Level 40. I. Was that me that whistled? Quickly get ourselves set up. Get a bit of crafting going on. I need stone to craft anything. All right, well, watch out. I heard a whistle. I'm sure that wasn't me that whistled. I see a base there. Hello. Let's get myself armed to the nines. Get myself ready for my first raid. Could be some sweets and treats in there indeed. Get a pick on me. Hello there, cheeky pick. What can I pick? Pick, pick. Has this not been raided? This hasn't been raided. Well, guess what I'm doing right off the bat? Let him know who raided him. Let's make a tribe. Rassels. Man made a thatch gaff. And there's stuff in there. That could be stuff for me. 2352. This person is actually online. Hang on a minute. Let myself. Oh, hello there. Okay, I'm going to do the friendly dance. Do the friendly dance. Don't pipe me, bro. Don't pipe me, bro. I'm friendly, man. I'm friendly, bro. Oh no, <laughs> I nearly got caught in the act. Are you okay there, man? How you doing, dudes? You right there? I like your gaff. You got a lovely, got a lovely looking gaff, gaff there. I'll put my friendly hands up. Hey there. I'm friendly, bro. Do the friendly hand dance. You got a lovely base there, dudes. What you got in there? Any sweets or treats? If you want to talk to me, you can. No? All right, he, he ain't bothered with me. He sees a bub. He says, nah. Do I need to be worried about that bub? Certainly don't. Bloody hell, we're getting metal off the bat. Is this a metal rock? What the hell? Noticing there's not a singular creature in sight right now. It's just me and a random human 2345. <laughs> I guess this is how we're starting in this remote, weird beach area. I've got a dude here. If he opens his door, hello, sir. I, I come to sell you some biscuits. Don't punch it with my fists. Oh, there we go. There he is. He's back. He's back. He's back. He's back. He's back. Hello. Burn him up, man. Oh, that's right, baby. I mean, <laughs> gaff now. What are you gonna do? <laughs> he's got. A, oh, he's got a crossbow on him. Is he going to try and shoot me from inside? <laughs> what have you got? What have you got, dude? <laughs> I can't even see. Like, it's so bright out there. All right, you got any loot for me, killer? What you got? Bow. That'll do. Good start. Got a trank arrow. What are you saying, son? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. It was, a, it was a bad day. It was a bad day for you, son. <laughs> oh, no, right. You just have them. Whilst I get myself sorted. I just come to get a few bits of loot. Listen, I'll give you a torch. No, I won't, actually. I'll give you some stone. I don't need that. You can have some berries as well. That'll help you out for a while, right? Keep you keep living the dream. I'm just going to go and check out to see what you've got. Is that all right? Um, do you know what? I'll take your 
fibre as well. Sorry, mate. Anything else? Bit of bit more cooked meat for the road. You got a bit of metal. Burning a bit of metal. I've got a crossbow off the bat. That's pretty good, isn't it? All right, I tell you what, Lucas. That's all I'm going to take off you. That's all I want. Honestly, this is a massive benefit. Thank you very much for the crossbow, Lucas. I really do hope you survive. Good luck to you. All right. I mean, so far, it's, you know, it's a nice looking map full of trees, full of bush. We probably want to get very, very far away from Lucas. I don't think he's going to be too happy about that. I think he might have logged off. Oh, he went, he's gone for a good sleep anyway. All right, we got a demo off up here. Dirty, dirty seagull. A crossbow is a win. Look at this. Feels kind of barren. I'm tempted to go more inland right now. Oh, hang on. I see another base here. Got any water skins, dude? All right. Looks like they haven't been on for a hot minute. All right, you're fully stone. I'm guessing... Is this door... That's a stone door. Right? I'm not getting in that one then. Oh, this is snow. Come on. Give me that heat back. Let me warm up, mate, baby. Let me warm up. All right. I need, I need somewhere... Very, very hidden. Let's die here in these trees right here. Where it also seems to be snowy. Maybe I shouldn't have started here. Maybe this was a bad idea. Ah! Ryan! To the Great North! Nope. Bruh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the... F <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> ah, five dollars. Five dollars well spent there, dude. That's my gear gone. That's my gear gone. Yeah, you got anything else for me, dudes? I'm in, I'm in a bit of a bad way. Are you still here? Lucas, you got anything new? I'll take that now. <laughs> I got nothing else. So, where am I safe then to go inland? Is there a whole invisible... Area that destroys all my stuff, or what? I died there, and then I think I ran up there. Oh, you're joking. There ain't no bag there, is there? That's bollocks, man. All right, fine. All right, we're gonna go back and back leaving Lucas's gaff for a minute. All right, there you go, mate. Oh, I've got you some metal burning now. How about that, eh? Living the dream. Two narcs, that ain't enough. All right, let's venture on. Let's take a little bit of this and that, a uh, bit of that, a bit of that. Ooh, whoever this is, been busy, busy hard at work. Ooh, 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 it's a base. Has it got things? Damn it. Ooh, it's got a few things though, and gone and gone and gone. Come on. Any sweets or treats? Is that it? That is it. Oh, that is not a parasaur. I recall this looks a bit different. That's an Appalachian parasaur. Oh, look at this dude. There we go. That's a big dude, man. Can we knock it out? Stick some Mejos up his bum bum. There we go. Beautiful. All right, eat some of them. That Therizino is dangerously close to that. Oh, my God. Well, that's certainly a better creature to tame. We're good. We're good. Okay. Applebee. Oh, you are joking. No. No. Oh. Oh. Really? Oh, for crying out loud. Go that way. Go, go, go. Go, son. Oh, my God. Danger. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the? Throw the bowlers. Crap. Where did the other one go? Is he dead? Is that fighting my dude? Applebee, Applebee, come to me, Applebee. Oh man, that sucks. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Suck your mum, man. Oh, well, there we go. Welcome to Ark. Oh, I'm so close. There we go, there we go, there we go. Two percent to pop. This is gonna take some time. A few hours later. Nah, this is yeah, this is taking too long. Alright, nah, we, I give up. It ain't, it ain't a fight I need to have. Oh balls! What is that? Oh my god! <laughs> 
Ah. Oh well. Oh, it's a base that that's been fortified to some degree. Oh, oh, they got carnos. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So we found something. Tribe of Tiny Dancer. What have you got? A stone gaff. Wooden gaff with a hole in the top. With people in here. Naked people. Might be raided. Can't tell if it is. The, the fact there is a roof. A hole in the top. Means maybe it has been raided. Jeez. Balls. Oh. No, 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 no. We went from a fabulous start to this, to this. All right, is that enough for a saddle? Yes, boy. Right. Now we're living the dream. Let's go. We have our first deed. And we're off. There we go. Right. Let's go for pointing that, pointing that, pointing that. Right, let's go. Let's move. Yeah, so far very flat. I'm not a big fan of flat maps. I like to see a bit of elevation. I'm hoping it's just because of the sheer size of the map. That there's plenty of places to go right now. This thing has got a wide rear end. Is this a base? Or is this a pre-made... This is a pre-made structure, right? Because we can't build with... Is this a base? Nah, this is pre-made. Ooh. All right. Oh, this is nice. These spiked walls are all pre-made and they've simply just had to fill in a gated entrance. Oh, I love it. Got themselves a lovely looking gaff here. Looks like they've built in that building there. So it could be a bit challenging. Oh, there's a whole village over there. Let's go and check out this. Oh, wow. And there's one there. Ooh. I wonder if there's anything you can, like, salvage from this. Little wood storage. Oh, this is lovely. Anything here we can take solace with? Holy crap. There's a whole village up here. Oh, this is lovely, though. Just a shame there's, like, not many creatures about to really do anything with this place I, I i like this i think it looks great looks grand where are we now are we finally we're not even at the north of the map yet we're not even there yet all right let's keep going until we can actually see ourselves on the map oh, there's another village here as well wow obsidian for days down here am i right with is that a mining shelter Oh, it's more than that. All right, I, before we... Oh, do I want to? I totally want to go down there, but before I do, we gotta, we got to make a bed. we got to make a bed. We'll secure this in this little shantytown village for a second. This looks like a safe place to keep this right here. Kind of boxed away. Is it boxed away enough? Hopefully it is. Right, you have all my gear. I'm going to go down here. This cave naked. Um, do I want to do it here? Yeah, screw it, man. All right, sweet. We got a bed. All right, then. Our first little exploration. Oh, it's a decent sized mine shaft. Is it full of nooks and crannies and traps? There's a wealth of crystal in here. Oh, this is nice. Crystal for days. Rewarding the exploration. Crystal, obsidian. A dead end, maybe? Is it a dead end? Can I get the in there? Doesn't look like I can. That's like one stone gate, that is, to box ourselves in. But hey, this ain't about that. This is about adventure in the great beyond. Right, job done. 
All right, let's get a smithy going down. So many trees, man. Wood is not an issue on this map. I'll tell you that for free. Lovely. All right, smack a smithy. Yeah, hey. Space required. Sucks. I want to make this house like... A... Oh, there's a whole upper floor to this place. Can you... Okay, you can't go up there. There we go. Right, sweet. <laughs> there's that Rex. What level is he? 50? you reckon yeah we can take it son that's a good chunk of hide if we kill this all right it's a bit busy at the moment as well which is even better although there is a trike there is... a trike would be useful hi son baby I see me. All right, we're on, we're on. Here we go. Oh. Come on, son. Really? We're giving up there? We're giving up here? Come on, you bum. There we go, and we're off, and we're off. That's it, right here, dudes. Right here, mate. Are we? Oh. <laughs> no. Oh, crap. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Why have I spawned in the bed? Oh, no. Oh, no, not this again. We found these things far too fine before. The, I don't know. There's some weird mesh game with some of these places that... If you try and spawn at a bed in a pre-built base, you just get teleported... The game says, no, this bed, you cannot spawn here because you're in the mesh or something to that degree. And then the game just, just doesn't allow you to spawn there. So now we've got this issue. He's looting, what's he doing? A Tribe Called Quest. A Tribe Called Quest, it's a great name. All right, just, um, what have you been collecting then whilst? You got nothing at all. Oh, this dude has nothing. Oh, 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 I'll take that, I'll take that. Thank you. Let's <laughs> <laughs> take the, the stuff. He was offloading back to his base, I guess. Oh, that's hilarious. This dude actually might have some gear. Think about that for a second. Are they still ferrying back and forth? Their door's still open. Just heard a whistle. Dude's on a harvest game. All right, just gonna have to be a little bit careful here. Is he trying to tame that horse? Let's see him. Where'd he go? Right. Oh, there he is! I wonder if you can bowler him off the, off the tamed horse. Right, he's just whistled passive on that Parasaur as well, so that's great.
feel kind of bad, man. In fact, hang on a minute. No, 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 no. If that's the dude taming their horse, they've just left their base wide open. Off taming a horse, that's going to take them a hot minute if they've got carrots. Whilst they're doing that, we'll go and check out what's in their base. Because they left the door open. Let's go. Oh, they didn't leave that door open though, did they? Damn it. All right, anything outside? Water reservoir. Anything in here? No. I bet they're all in that building, right? All right, quick, 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 quick. I'm surprised they left the gate open, dude. PT there. Level 28, tribe called Quest. Okay, they've got nothing here. Okay. There's nothing there. Let's just check the boat one more time. I reckon they'll be taming that for a hot minute. All right, they're definitely all done here. Okay, cool. Right, there's their parasaur. Which they are now on. D gave up on the horse. Damn it, I think we missed our opportunity. Oh, tempting, but he, he could whistle that. That Therizino, though, that's scary, man. Like, that's death. That's death. If, if I get near that. But, if I, can, if I can get into their building and kill them. Okay. I don't want to be outside this base, just in case. It could be the end. I'm not careful. What sort of player are they? They're a door opening sort of player. There is two storage boxes in here and that's it. Okay, that's all you've got. Where's the rest of your gear then? Where's your smithy? Where's all your Where's all your bits and bobs, dude? Go, 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 go. Pike. I'll do. Thank you very much for the goods. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got loads of metal ingots, but that, I can't go for them, man. Oh, did they have hide? That's what I need. Just chilling there. His door's still wide open. He's man's busy building. Like a tribe called Quest is just on their build game. Just be careful. They don't know. They don't know. <laughs> They're like, why is my crossbow? Where's my crossbow just gone? It just disappeared on me, man. We'll, we'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. The stealth game worked. Right. Thank you for the hide. That's what I needed. All right, throw that in. We got a crossbow. There we go. There we go. Let's make a few bowlers for the roads. Okay, and maybe even a parachute wouldn't be go and miss, you know. Can make a parachute, fiber and thatch. It does feel like it's way more of a grind this map. I think. All right, two shoots. All right, leaving the dream. Look at this. All set up now, baby. Um, I'll keep that torch just in case. I just need something to tame right now. Boom. Rex Slade and Hyde Giveth. Right now we're talking. Okay. Right, we got arrows galore now. We we gotta we gotta find something to tame dudes. 
Monkey on the car. You go get a poop thrower. That'll be definitely a worthy thing to have. Hey, we got a Dave. All right, let's get involved. That is a Spino. Okay, must mean we are possibly in a swampier section. If we are, are there frogs about? Two decent land travel mounts. All right, 15 is a bit whack, but hey. It's a frog. Oh. 40. What level am I? Oh, not even close, dude. What is that? Is a spino. Oh my god. Level 10. What do you reckon? Maybe? Come at me, bro. No, no, no. Donkey. Use the trees. Use the trees as cover. There we go. You gotta throw poop. Throw poop at this thing. Please throw poop at this thing. You gotta throw poop at it. How am I meant to? How am I meant to hit that? Oh my god! Bloody hell! Oh! Oh, that was dicey! Oh no! We just died to nothing again! Nah, nah, nah. Honestly, like, if you can't even sort that out, me running about and dying to anti mesh, it ain't, it, it, it shouldn't be worth a single single penny sorry i'm a big fan of kaluga and i think this map certainly speaks some volumes but if i'm dying to anti-mesh i've just lost all my gear again how how on earth how on earth can this possibly be an official map okay so we started about here somewhere in the great beyond where we raided our first dude somewhere along these beaches here let's see if we can follow our path it's so big of a map. It certainly is. Not as wide as it seemed to suggest. I felt dwarfed to this map. I really did. So we went somewhere. I'm guessing this is north. So we moved along here somewhere. Very hard to see with all this fog. Okay, well, I never saw a plane of water that big. So maybe we was further over this way then. Here we go. That's the dude. <laughs> that we snuck into. This was the base that he was in. We were living up where, in these buildings over here, just over this village here. Okay, so that's where we were. We were living down here with the mine shaft in there. And then we moved along up here, pretty much through the trees dead north. So this was dead north now. And this, somewhere here, is where we died. I don't know, maybe there. Maybe over there. I'm not sure. That I didn't see before. Look at this. Look at this. Cannon surrounding it as well. So that entire adventure was us going from about there to about here somewhere. And there is so much more to uncover. Apparently there are artifact caves to explore. Lots of dense, dense trees, dude. This is a big map. What's interesting is even with the fog and the clouds turned off, there's still some like weather effects. And here we go, the Redwoods is way over here. With the whole snow biome ready and waiting. Wow, and there we go. There's an obelisk right there. Two obelisks, broken obelisks. Certainly, possibly signifying something perhaps, but with Dying to mesh, man. I, I just wouldn't. I wouldn't want to play this right now with that issue. Very, very wastelandy. Very flat. Lots of room to to create much more detail. Can't be denied. It's a beautiful looking map. It really is. All of this took to adventure beyond. And then that's the redwoods wrapping around to this mountain over here. Really elevated here. So... That whole section there at the start with it feeling so flat, it is just the beginner section, I guess. You know, once you finally reach these areas, then you're 
Really in for a treat. There you go, there's another obelisk here. Very, really interesting how the obelisks are working, that there is none. There, there is no obelisks, they're broken, sunken, overrun. With, is there any way to transfer on and off these maps? Holy oil. <laughs> Grief. Lots to explore. So much to explore. And definitely a great adventure awaiting people. But playing it legit with stuff like that happening, that, that's a bare minimum. I can't, I can't. I can't recommend it, I'm afraid. Of course, on unofficial and single player, you can play the game without that happening. You can turn those settings off. But it does beg the question, you know, uh, if you're going to host this unofficial, you've got to get those things right. If Wildcard are going to host this as an official map, you can't have people dying to anti-mesh out in the open. That's very unfair. But hey, there you go, people. There's Appalachia. There's... My initial look, perspective, thoughts, and wonders about this very certainly detailed map. Congratulations to Kaluga on the time put into this. It's a great map. It just needs some work to go. There we go. So until the next one, my name is Ross Clark. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, uh, peace out. Oh.